I probably started age 12, playing football seriously, I guess. Before that, it was just at school, playing, playing with my mates, having fun. But yeah, I'd say around that 12, 13 age is when I started playing my club football and then um, was lucky enough to, to kick on and, and play at Queensland teams and stuff like that. This is my first proper season, um, so I just want to get myself very, really fit during pre-season um, and obviously try and get as many minutes as I can. But I also want to win things. While I've been at Lions, I've loved winning, so I just want to keep that, keep that going, I guess. Obviously when you're younger, you just think, oh, you know, dad played soccer, dad played football, that's cool. Um, but but as, I, as I've gotten older and, and now I'm coming into the professional game, I realise how hard it is what he's achieved and, and how amazing it actually is. He had a special, special career, to be honest. Got into the national team early, played all of his career in Korea, in the K-League. Probably my earliest memory is going to the games, watching uh, Marconi, which is where he played. And they had some, some unbelievable crowds back then in the, in the old NSL, obviously. Uh, I was just looking through and obviously the, the sad news of Maradona passing away. Um, and I remember dad saying, you know, I've, I've played with him. And I used to just be like, no, no, you haven't. You just get out. Like, and then he was saying, yeah, yeah, no, I actually marked him in a couple games. And, and I, was, I couldn't believe him. Um, and so I just thought, you know, why don't I hop on YouTube? Funny enough, I've, I found a video of of, the, of them um, lining up together for a match, so it's just unbelievable to be honest. What he accomplished was awesome, unbelievable. But yeah, obviously I want to walk my own path and he's been there, done that I guess, but he was never one to sort of push it onto me. Yeah, it was always me that sort of took it on and you know, after having fun, I, I decided, you know, why don't we give this a proper crack, so yeah. I got chucked in straight away after playing in the MPL into some pretty big games near the back end of the season. Um, but yeah, I, I loved it, loved every minute. He's a great kid, he's got a great attitude, uh, always here with a smile on his face, wants to work hard, wants to be involved in uh, all the sessions and you know, I can't speak highly enough of him as a person, you know, he's a great person on and off the field. I, I know how Mooney wants to play and, and I think he knows what kind of attributes I bring to the table. Ever since I came back to Brisbane uh, to play MPL, he, he was the one who, who gave me a shot. You know, he's got a lot of good qualities. He's one of those unsung heroes that, uh, you know, he doesn't get a lot of attention, but, but what he does, he does really well. He's really drilled in positivity and, and um, having a single goal for the team. Um, and I think the whole team's picked it up as well and, and everyone wants to win at Brisbane, so it's been awesome. We've got quality in the squad. Uh, I'm fully confident. I mean, ever since we got knocked out of the semis last year, just the single goal has just been to do one better. Let's get to the final and then we can win things. That's it, simple. It's, it's everyone's dream to be a professional footballer. Uh, I'm, just, I'm super grateful that I've got the opportunity now. Uh, it did take me a while to get here, if I'm honest, and you know, I just want to make the most of it, yeah.